being offered for Mary and Rosha. This week's second collection will be for the cemetery update. And please check the bulletin for this month's mission co-op collection information. Next weekend, September 5th and 6th, there will be a free will special offering collection for Beirut Relief, and there are no envelopes. There is a parents meeting Wednesday at 6.30 in the main church for those parents who did not attend the one past week. Friday is First Friday. This, there will be an exposition of the Blessed Sacrament on the front porch following Mass at eight, after 8 a.m. Mass until noon. And Saturday is First Saturday in honor of the Blessed Virgin Mary, and Mass will be at 8 a.m. Please join with me in the prayer to St. Michael the Archangel. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us this battle, be our protection against the wickedness and sins of the devil. May God be with you. Lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God. 
God forever and ever. Amen. Amen.
gain the whole world and forfeit his life? Or what can one give in exchange for his life? For the Son of Man will come with his angels in his Father's glory. And then he will repay all according to his conduct. The Gospel. Praise, Praise you. Praise you. And he says, I'm the 
theological laughter. Everybody mocks me because I profess you.
We live in a world today that is very cruel, very unkind. Maybe some of you are as sick and tired as I am about all the disinformation that we hear, the lies, the fake news. I pray every day, Walter Cronkite, why don't you please come back? Why do you have to die? We don't know who to believe it. Even this thing of the pandemic, we don't know what to believe. Some say it's going to be a crisis. And others say, yeah, the election is all about just this.
being on all those crazy diocesan committees that I'm on, I know how much this hurt a short. Can you fail to realize how acidic our problems are? The little white lies, the gossip, the stories, the maliciousness, I don't want to scare anybody away. But you know how many times I sit in that box and I have somebody say, you know, Father, I gossip a little bit, but it isn't meant to hurt anybody. I want to take my hands and throw them to the screen and grab them. Because guess what? It does hurt me. So Helen, I won't tell anybody maybe you pick your nose or something.
I believe in one God, Father the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all things visible and invisible. I believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, born of the Father before all ages, God from God, the light of mind, true God from true God, begotten not in me, consubstantial with the Father, through him all things were made, for us to stand for our salvation. Mighty and eternal God, for you so love the world that in your mercy you sent us the redeemer. 
Redeemer, to live like us in all things but sin, so that you might love in us what you love in your Son, by whose obedience we have been restored to those gifts of yours, that by sinning we had lost in disobedience. And so, Lord, to all the angels and saints, we too give you thanks as an exaltation we acclaim.
the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin, safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Forgive the power of the Lord our prayers now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church. Graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will. We live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit.
So if you give us an extra five minutes or something after Mass today to help wipe